Thank you, Dave. Today, the Erie County Department of Health and UBMD held a news conference to talk about important safety measures for parents and caregivers of young children. That's because the county medical examiner's office reported six deaths of children under the age of three over a recent four week period. The suspected causes of death were all either respiratory illness or unsafe sleeping practices. Several pediatricians shared the signs you should look for that an infant may be in respiratory distress. Kids usually wanna play and they are active. So you see a kid that is very tired, is not waking up. Um, maybe you have a little bit of fever, you give them Tylenol, but after the Tylenol, they don't recover, they seem to be tired, they are not drinking, they are not wetting diapers. All of those are signs of alarm that would prompt a visit to the pediatrician. So the first line of defense is always your pediatrician. So don't hesitate to take your kid to your primary care physician, pediatrician, or family physician. Um, there are other signs that should prompt an ED visit, so an immediate call to EMS or 911. If you see a kid that's very limp, or they have the lips blue, that's a sign that there is not enough oxygen going through the body, and that's a reason to call 911 or get the kid to the emergency room. As for safe sleeping habits, doctors say parents should make their babies sleep alone without blankets or toys, be on their backs, and sleep only in a safe crib. Pediatricians also say to avoid smoking in a home with a baby that will reduce their risk of sudden infant death.